There's a premium on youth, isn't there? In our culture, in this business, it's magnified. And I learned this when I was in my early 40s, how you just have to look young for this business. And I was in LA, I had a good set. So did all the other young comics, early 30s, 20s. They had good sets. After the show, there's a man in a suit, very important looking, across the crowd. He was eyeing all the comics. And we thought, oh, this is, he's a manager, he's an agent, he's coming towards us, somebody's gonna get a break. Who will it be, the older guy who's paid his dues, or one of the youngsters? He came straight to me, only I got his card. Was he a manager, was he an agent? No, he was a plastic surgeon. <laughs> and, uh... Oh, and I got his last card, by the way. Plastic surgeon with one card, 300 people, I got the card. <laughs> what does that say? And I, I asked him, you think I need surgery? I don't think, I mean, I've been thinking about it, but you think I need surgery, I'm not ugly. And he said, well, come by my office sometime, we can talk about it. And I said, well, can't you just eyeball a diagnosis? <laughs> In fact, did you not just eyeball a diagnosis? <laughs> okay. When you gave me your last card, making me the winner of your little ugly contest right there? Can, can't they just eyeball it? Does anybody know? Or are these plastic surgeons like all the other doctors? You know, they, they take your pulse and they weigh you and measure your height. Then there's blood samples, urine samples, stool samples. Do the plastic surgeons do that? Call you a few weeks later with the results from the lab. Well, we got your results back, sir. And uh, you do not look good. <laughs> Much worse than we thought. We, we found ugly in your blood, your urine, and your stool. High levels in your stool. You are butt ugly. I, I, I think you should do something about this immediately. This is... You don't want to die like this. I recommend emergency elective surgery. Uh, first thing Monday morning, I'm gonna cancel all the other appointments. They'll be kind of upset because they're a little ugly too, but I'm, sh I'm gonna show them your picture. They'll understand. And then you would say, well, oh, this is weird. I did not even feel ugly. <laughs> and he would say, well, you've probably been ugly for years. <laughs> you just got used to it. <laughs> as did everyone around you. <laughs> so. Hey, did you know that Dry Bar Comedy has their own app? Download it right now to watch, save, and share clips, and watch my whole special.